Okay, so we have uh, an older language called Visual Basic, and the new version is VB.net. So uh, Basic stands for Beginners All-Purpose Symbolic Instruction Code, and uh, developed as an extension of the programming language called C to be a general-purpose programming language. And uh, Visual Basic. So BASIC was a language a long time ago. And then uh, after that, they developed something called Visual BASIC. BASIC plus a graphical user interface, uh, a GUI. Uh, greatly eases the creation of Windows applications, especially by facilitating the use of reusable components. So you make uh, uh, a little program, and you can use it again. Uh, VisualBasic.net, a programming language based on VB 6.0. So Visual Basic, there are uh, various versions up to 6. And then uh, they developed VisualBasic.net, working on the so-called net framework of Microsoft Corporation. So they came up with a net framework. That just means a bunch of programming li libraries. That just means a, like a bunch of um, uh, functions or things that you can use uh, in your programming that make your programming uh, life easier. So you have things that are already written for you, so you don't have to do everything yourself. Uh, a, and then they say a platform for cross-language development. So that means that uh, I guess you can do certain things in visualbasic.net and also maybe uh, similar things in C Sharp. C++ and F Sharp. So these are just different programming languages from Microsoft. Uh, includes a large standard library called the Base Class Library, BCL. And then they also provide something called Visual Studio. And I made a video on how to get a copy of Visual Studio. And I explained a little bit about what it is. But basically, you can, in, in simplest terms, you could just say, it's like a, it's like Notepad plus plus. I'm sorry. It's like Notepad or Microsoft Word. It's just a, um, a place to type your code, but it has lots of things to make it make the typing easier. Just like, for example, in Microsoft Word, uh, I think there's like spell checking and things like that. So it makes uh, typing a document easier. And in Visual Studio, they have other. Um, useful features that make typing code easier. Uh, Microsoft Integrated Development Environment, uh, IDE, so that's just a word that means uh, a place where you can type your code and it, it's very convenient. IDE, Integrated Development Environment, a place that makes it easy to type your code for VisualBasic.net, uh, intended mainly for Windows applications and also web applications. So we will use Visual Studio 2012 to create all of our programs.